Ecclesiasticus 21 and 2, it reads, Flee from sin as from the face of a serpent. For if thou comest too near it, it will bite thee. The teeth thereof are as the teeth of a lion slaying the souls of men. Call Halayim, Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem, Yahweh Kodash. The bottles to the apostles and elders of the great millstone. Peace, blessings, salutations to the hopefully elect on the four corners of the earth. Putting in this work in faith and truth and in sincerity, risking life and freedom on a daily basis to do so. And to the few sisters that are trying to see the word of Yahweh Shai, and I'm going to speak in silence as pursuant to the scriptures. And so, um, read the scripture uh, in Sirach, 24 chapter, uh, second verse. Flee from sin as from the face of a serpent, man. Okay? Let's give you a warning, a commandment that you ought to flee from sin, man. But it seems like our people love go go to sin like a moth to the, to the flame, man. All right, and we're commanded to flee from sin, right? If you see a snake, if you all of a sudden walk up on the, on the, on the snake, you immediately you jump, your heart will jump in your throat, man, and you'll turn around and go the other way, man. Right? You run it, run it like you think the snake is right behind you, man. Right? Same thing, man. Right? That's how, as a righteous um, man man of the Lord, you should you should flee from sin, man, all right? Because if you come too near sin, it will bite thee, and the teeth of the lion that, that slayeth me, it'll drag you back into the world, man, okay? Because what, what, what is sin, man? Sin is transgression um, transgression of the law, man, as pursuant to 1 John uh, 3 and 24, man, right? So we're supposed to be living our lives according to the law, and the commandments of the, of the Bible, man, all right? Let me, um, let me just get it real quick. It's locked here. First John 3 and 4. Whosoever committed sin transgresses also, also the law, for sin is the transgression of the law. So the law is not done away with, man. Like they teach you in these damn, these whole houses, man. These holy houses, what you call a church house, man. Okay. When you look up the word church, it's the word in the Greek ecclesia, which means to call out, man. Right? It's not a um, physical building, man. Okay? Because the scriptures tell you to get the most. I said, what temple will you be? Build me, man. What temple are you going to build me with man has, man? Have I not made all these things, man? All right? So you people have been have, have been duped, all right, by this devil, man. All right? So my point is, is that. You know, we should, we should, us being a spiritual people, men of the Lord, we should, we should at least fight to try, you know what I'm saying, to be upright, but it's only for the elect, man, okay, this is not a, you know, so let me, I'm, I'm, I'm back up, man, this is, this is a thing of election, man, if it's for the elect, you're going to be able to elect, you're going to, going to feel the word of your house, you're going to fall to the best of your ability, if you're the two-thirds, you're going to keep being a, a fucking nigga, man, okay, so, but this is just a um, warning, man, as we commanded to do. The scriptures have commanded us to do Jeremiah 51 and 6. Flee out of the midst of Babylon and deliver every man his soul. Right? Spiritually flee out of Babylon. You're not gonna you're not gonna catch a train or or, or, or airplane ticket out, out of this out of this in, incoming destruction of America, aka Babylon, the great. Right? It's gonna um you're gonna be delivered, okay, by who you ignorant what people ignorant call UFOs. Which are the chariots of Israel. That's another, that's another lesson, man. Okay, so Jeremiah 51 and 6 it says, flee out of the midst of Babylon spiritually, flee out of her. Okay. Every man is soul. Be not cut off from her iniquity, man. Don't receive the, the punishment of America, man. All right. For this is the time of Yahweh's vengeance. He will render her unto her a, a recompense, man. He's gonna pay her back for all the wickedness that, that she's done, man. Okay, including where did the list start and where do it stop, man? Cover the faces of the judges thereof, man. Blasphemy. You know what I'm saying? The uh, bloodshed. It's all our wickedness. Lie. All right. The the the, the pale male, wicked E has a has a, a a tremendous bill, uh, to pay, man. Okay, a tremendous bill to pay. All right, and it's going to be paid, uh, in full, man. Okay, please understand that. Let me um. Let's go to. Isaiah 52 and 11, where it reads, 
Depart ye, depart ye, go ye out from thence. Touch no unclean thing, go ye out of the midst of her. Be ye clean and bear the vessels of the Lord, man. So don't partake in the ways. Get your change, change, get your shit together, man. Change it, how, how you move, man. Let your thoughts be your thoughts according to the words of Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Let how you move be according to the way to the words of Yahweh Bashim Yahweh man. Don't be totally engulfed in this madness and this witchcraft and this out here like a fucking crash dummy, man. But again, somebody has to be uh, the, the two-thirds, man. But you've been warned, man. Come out of the midst of Babylon, man. Let that bullshit go, man. Okay? Let's, um, Romans 12. <clears throat> so like you. Romans 12 and 2. Be not conformed to this world, but be ye transformed by the renewing of your mind. That ye may prove what is that good and acceptable and the perfect will of the most high power, man. All right. All right, so like you. <clears throat> so again. Be not conformed with this world, man. Be not, be not with. Don't, don't just go along with this world, man. Don't go along to get along, man. Just because you see a masses of people doing it, that don't mean that's the right thing to do, man. Okay. But if you want to come into this truth, if you say you're a man of the Lord and you believe you got faith, and and, and you got faith in Yahweh Shema Shai, and you begging for deliverance, you begging that you elect, man. So you're gonna be uh, renewed by the mind, man. You're not gonna be the same nigga that you was, man. You're gonna think different, you're gonna speak different, you're gonna act different, you're gonna talk different, man. You're gonna move differently, man. Okay, we're not gonna be caught up in this in, in this witchcraft, man, and this and, and, and this the babal yayan, the madness of this place, man, which is soon gonna be um soon gonna be done away with, man. All right. So let me get one more. This is Second Corinthians six. And 16. Uh, it reads 2 Corinthians 6 and 16 and what agreement hath the temple of the most high power with idols for ye are the temple of the living power and as the most high power have said I will dwell in them and walk in them and I will be their power and they should be my people wherefore come out from among them and be separate saith Yahweh and touch not the unclean thing and I will receive you, man. Okay, so what agreements do the temple of the most high power, okay? Which is the which is us. Okay, we are the temple. Your body is the temple. Okay. We're talking about the elect, man. Not you, you pork cigarette smoking uh, eating niggas, man. Okay. We are the temple of the most high power, man. Okay. And the most high said he would dwell in them and walk in them. Okay. So that again to show you that the temple of the most high power is not a, a physical brick and mortar building, man. You people run into the church house the church and the work, and we look it up, that word church in, in the Greek is ecclesia, which means to call out, man. All right? So, um, and that's what you see with the apostles and the elders, the great millstone, and many men on the four corners of the earth. That's what you see them doing, man, calling out, man. That's the church, man. I'm saying, they say, go out to the highways and byways and bid those to the marriage, man. But I'm not for everybody, man. I don't be let go hear this call and, 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 uh, and, and receive the word, man. All right? So, final warning, man. Okay? If you believe in the most high power, you feel the Lord, man, okay? Come back to your power, come back to your nationality, man. Hey, man, change, get your mind right, man. All right? You have no agreement with, with idols, man. All right? Come, come out of her, man. Get your mind right, man. Set your heart right, man. All right? Your love, your mind, man. Or get destroyed, man. Call Allah, Yom Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shah, Bahashem, Rekha, Kodash. Double honor to the apostle and others, great millstone peace, blessed and salutation to the hopefully elect in the four corners of the earth. Put in this work in faith and truth and sincerity, rest in life and freedom on a daily basis to do so. A bob, a bob. Shout out.